I've been in choir all four years. It's been really fun. I was in Allstate, mainly just doing schoolwork, which Rock Canyon is known for, like being a really prestigious school. Um, so just kind of fitting in with the crowd. He's very kind, very patient. He has a great quick wit, which I love seeing that pop out. I've been through a, a plethora of things, um, to say the least. Kendall's been through a lot, even since birth. He was a preemie, so he was in the NICU for a month. Lung issues since a young child, um, anxiety, <laughs> some depression in middle school. Kendall was one of those kiddos that a lot of times would suffer in silence. He's such a kind person and a person that doesn't want to burden anybody. So he tended to put himself on the bottom of the priority list. He would come in and just kind of, I think, ride the wave, ride the wave of the emotions and kind of get things under control and then head back to class. Going into freshman year, I got um, taxoplasmosis, which took away the vision in my left eye which was really scary. I didn't really know how to deal with it, but I learned to um, be able to lean on the people around me. It was all good until like junior year um, when I got diagnosed with scoliosis and kyphosis. I've been kind of watching his back thinking things didn't look quite right and sought the help of a medical professional to confirm what my mom gut was telling me and decided to go forward with the surgery. I, I got through it and then I got a staph infection five weeks later, which um, had three other surgeries, which um, was not was not fun at all. He, he was just Kendall at his core, just kind, friendly, always saying thank you to the nursing staff. He held my hand a lot, which is my kid. I love it when he leans over. He's just a, a sweet young man. Um, it was hard to see him struggle as a mom, I wanted to take it away. I had a lot of people helping me, which I think definitely helped me get through um, the things that I've been through. The recovery is kind of extensive. It was a lot of physical therapy. I was put on the homebound education, and I had the school nurse, I had my counselor, I had a bunch of people um, that just at the ready to help me, which was really cool. He was never late with a class. He stayed on top of it. Once he was like aware and off medications, he was back at it. Ever since then, I've gotten back to normal. Um, I've been able to um, do a lot of stuff that I was doing beforehand, feeling a lot better. I'm super proud of Kendall. Like he's one of the kids that stand out and I've been doing this a really long time. We're really proud to watch the baby of our family graduate. Words can't describe it. You know, he's, he's set for great things. Couldn't be prouder of my son. He's, uh, like I said, he was, he didn't just get through his challenges and persevere, but he did it well. He set the bar high for himself and he really exceeded. I'm excited, um, like 12 years in the making. Also nerve wracking, to say the least, because um, I'm going into a new playing field, but it's nothing I haven't done before. Like I've adapted to a little bit in my life. <laughs>